Hello, I'd like to talk about how to make your own solar hot water shower. Um, we did it, it was very easy, so I'd like to show other people how to do it. Here's the shower stall here. First thing we did was dig a trench in the ground from the shower stall all the way over to our house so we could connect with the existing plumbing. The shower is connected to the cold water under pressure coming from our house. So we dug a trench about 50 feet long just using a post hole digger. Um, didn't take long, took two people about an hour or so to do it when the ground's nice and soft. This water comes in underground and comes up into one of these two pipes here that you can see under the shower. Um, we actually have two pipes because we, pi we ran hot water out to the shower and then realized we really didn't need it at all. Uh, we also have under this concrete block here, and ignore the uh, garden watering hose on top, we also have under there a place to drain the entire system in the winter time which is extremely important or else the pipes will freeze and burst. So the cold water comes in through into, these, into this pipe here and it comes up into this connector here, pardon my toes, it's a great way to point, and then from here you see we have a hose and another hose. The hose comes out runs just along the ground, the grass has grown over it so you can't even see it, you can mow right over it and it comes up to here which is our solar hot water generator. Let me get in the shade so you can see it better. So what we have is just a big giant coil of black plastic well pipe. I'm not sure how many feet we have of it but we have it hanging up on uh, a little rail like that just to keep it out of the grass, make it easier to mow. It can just lie flat on the ground, it doesn't matter, but the more sun you get, the more hot water you'll get. So the cold water comes in one side of the loop, goes all the way through the coil, and comes out the other side, and comes back over to the shower. We've also got some rain barrels here where we're collecting water for a garden. They're not part of the shower system. So, the solar heated hot water comes back in to this side here where it goes up into the shower and then once you get inside the shower you can see that we've just got normal controls here hot on the left, cold on the right coming up to a shower head and we actually got fancy and put in a second shower head for people that might want to shower together. Um, it's a great system, it's worked really well for us. Um, we've got a nice little room here, a nice shower stall made up with a tile floor. You don't have to do any of that. Drainage is important, but the great thing is that if it's warm enough that you might want to take a shower outside, like a nice 80 degree day, you can do it. And the hot water is free. So I hope that others of you try it. Good luck.